everybody. I wanted to do a video today on how subliminal affirmations work. And, uh, you know, it's very, very... I'm all about credibility for all of you new people. And the more mature and experienced you get in life, you start to understand why. And I've had the privilege to study quantum physics my entire life. The subconscious mind and psychology. Not going to school for four or eight years and memorizing a bunch of history. And prescriptions and problems that the same family who owns the schools that also owns the pharmaceutical companies wants you to memorize and I'm very grateful I've studied what I call natural psychology where we have now cured lipedema, thyroid related issues, autoimmune disorder, oral bleeding in the mouth and also most recently a lady just posted and said hey I don't need wrist surgery anymore. And how have we done this? This is how subliminal affirmations work. And guys, I've uploaded a video on called why you're not getting subliminal affirmation results. And it's because unfortunately in a niche that has become so popular and so big, just like the self-help industry, you now have all of these younger people or not even younger people, just younger souls and people talking out of their butt who have no idea what they're talking about just for they could become famous, for they could get attention, for they can get a bunch of views, write out some booming niche. And it's disgusting. And it's why I started this nonprofit for free. We just uploaded a lesson the other day, a $500 to $1,500 lesson. Another self-help guru charges people to come watch. And these, these, these boys and these girls just pop up who have not even applied anything they're talking about telling you to go apply in your life <laughs> when they haven't even done anything with their own life. And I'm just like, dude, like that's great if you want to inspire people and you want to motivate people, but don't sit there and give them life advice when you're still living and haven't applied any of it yourself. Like be honest and be like, hey guys, let's do this journey together. I'm gonna self-improve and actually apply what I'm teaching you and then we can grow together. But don't sit there and bullshit a bunch of people just for you can selfishly, selfishly out of selfishness for you can be better. And guys, it's very important. You know, I'm very grateful in 30 years, I've gone from, not in 30 years, excuse me. <laughs> in eight years, when I was 17, in just eight years, I've gone from cleaning shit off of toilets, pushing in carts, 115 degree weather in Arizona. I've self-improved through 30 jobs to get to where I'm at now, to where I'm very grateful to be traveling the world. Next, I'm gonna be in Cancun next month, writing my book while I trade stocks all day, all week, making 50 to 200% gains on very large amounts of money. And I'm very grateful to also have played a father figure role in four beautiful children's lives in another country, live in other countries, different cities all around the world have deep conversations from here with people all around the world. At least a million people all around the world. Not just small talk, but real talk. And I've had this success. And it was not, there was a lot of rock bottoms along the way. It did not come overnight. But understanding the subconscious mind, our spiritual mind, imagination and perception, intuition, will, memory, and reason understanding energy and the science of life. You know, when Aristotle, who studied the science of life like Albert Einstein, would hold up an acorn seed to his class, he did not want them to say when he asked them, class, what do I have? He did not want them to say an acorn seed. He wanted them to say an acorn tree because through the gravitational patterns and this, the DNA inside of an acorn tree, it is going to through vibrations and the frequency of love, 528 hertz that flows through all of life, even the stars and the rainbows, that scientists put down into an ocean and cured oil spilled water in one day through the vibration of 528 hertz called the love frequency. He wanted his class to understand through this love frequency that the acorn seed was gonna turn into an acorn tree. Facebook, Instagram, all of these applications, just like life, you know, there was a scientist by the name of Claude Shannon. He discovered computer coding. 
not resembling computer coding, but exactly like computer coding inside of all of life. There, are, there is computer coding written inside all of the operations and systems of nature, just like computer coding. And when Facebook and these applications, there is something called hard coding. There is something called hard coding in these applications. What is hard coding? For you who don't know, it is how, it is Java or C++ or the computer coding language that computer programs type out literally with words that create with words Facebook and Instagram. That's all image based. That's all just clicking. And I've had the privilege to be on the internet for over 15 years now. And I will tell you, I understand how Facebook marketing, Facebook ads, Instagram ads, YouTube ads, Google ads. I understand when I go to a website now, I play around for a couple hours and I understand all of their systems of operations, the hard coding. That means 100% of the time, I understand what's going to happen if I do something. Not maybe, not I'm just guessing. Albert Einstein said it perfectly. Any fool or stupid person any fool is the correct technical term. Any fool can know. Any fool can repeat what he heard on TV without even fact-checking himself or doing research himself. Any fool can know. Any fool can know. But a wise man understands. When I study something now in life, I'm learning how to play the harp right now. Beautiful instrument. And I'm learning how to play the harp. And what I, I, I will tell you, when I play the harp and anything else in life, I want to understand the hard coding. I want to understand how things operate. A bicycle, no matter what, is always going to have two handlebars. Now, what kind of material you like, what kind of add-ons you want to add on to your bike is a matter of opinion. But the hard coding, the facts, and when somebody asks me, like, oh, I want, like, what should I buy? What kind of car should I buy? I want your opinions. I'm just like, you don't want an opinion. You want to find somebody that's an expert mechanic and actually understands that could build a car himself and will tell you br the brutally honest truth, which car is the best for your needs. Because he actually understands the systems and the operations 100% of the time what's going to happen. And there is more than just the law of attraction. There are 11 universal laws that we know exactly how the universe is going to work 100% of the time through studying it for thousands of years. This is how I, this is how I make 50% to 200% every week in the stock markets. It's through the science of life. I've studied my entire life and applying it and gaining all of the ex life experience I just mentioned. And why do I bring this up? What, does this have, what the hell does this have to do with subliminal affirmations, Luke? Like, what the hell are you talking about? Our subconscious mind, unless if you are an alien living on outer space, <laughs> welcome to planet Earth if you are, a little sarcasm, right? If you can't take a joke, then don't get out of bed. Unless if you are an alien living on another planet, or you came from another planet, you know, it's very important to understand that we all have a subconscious mind. We all have a thinking mind, even though I'm, I don't have Fred the monkey. I got Boo Boo here, the blue, the blue bear. I just made that name up. You gotta have a little creativity, right? Boo Boo here, the wheels in his head are not spinning. Boo Boo is an animal. Now, I love animals. I got a parakeet over there. I got Xan and his Snickers here. You guys are probably kind of staring at. Boo Boo, unfortunately, is an animal. Boo Boo cannot think. But we are human beings. <laughs> We can think, and common sense is not that common anymore. People's wills do not spin very often anymore. But we, every human being, has been born with the gift and the ability to freely think once the wills start spinning. Now, first, you have to understand and love yourself on the inside to where you have only one thinking voice, but that's a different video. Every human being has a subconscious, and every human being has spiritual thinking, or the spiritual mind. And the spiritual mind is... Imagination, perception, intuition, reason, will, and photographic memory or memory. 
we will never, never with hard, with physical or hard coding that you can see with the naked eye, be able to program the imagination, intuition, all of these higher faculties in a robot. These are spiritual, the spiritual mind that we, I call also the creative mind. These are what separate us from the animals. No other form of life has these. We have the ability through thinking in our subconscious mind. Okay, this is where we're going to dive in here. Your subconscious mind, just like I said, the computer coding in all of life. How do we reprogram this computer coding in our DNA, in our cells, our genes? Well, we reprogram our genes and our DNA through the subconscious mind. We have 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts a day that arise in your subconscious mind. And that's just depending on if you're running all day, you're working out, you have a day off from work, if you're at work, you're on vacation. Depending on what you do, if you're making love, if you're on a date, you know, whatever you're doing. You're driving all day to California or to Florida. You, I just thought about that. People from the South, they must go to Florida, right? You gotta think sometimes, guys. I think on the spot. We all can do this. But anyways, it's very important to understand our subconscious mind, your subconscious mind has 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts a day. And your conscious mind has the ability to think and reject or accept ideas. Our subconscious mind, your subconscious mind cannot reject. It has to accept. Now, through thinking, we can consciously tell our subconscious mind what we want it to do, what we want it to program. And the subconscious mind, these 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts, decide and program everything from your eye color, how you kiss, how you breathe when you kiss, how you walk, how confident you are, how you public speak, everything starts with your subconscious mind. Why? This is the, I just gave you the psychology side of things, and this is where a lot of psychologists or other people fall short and don't, okay, I, I've already heard all of this from other videos, right? This is how the subconscious mind works, right? It takes 21 days to reprogram our subconscious mind, or psychologists call them paradigms. I call them the algorithms of our subconscious mind. It takes 21 days to reprogram these, and then just like building muscles, it takes 90 days for your body or your reality, depending on if you're listening to personal development or physical subliminals, will then respond and start evolving with the new algorithms. Now, we, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to get very advanced. If you want advanced, go watch our video on the subconscious mind and the correlation to gravity and space. Space and time and the subconscious mind. I'm going to get more basic here, and I, I truly believe we all understand this, or I've heard this to some degree at least, that our thoughts decide what vibration or frequency we are operating on. And in quantum physics or energy, we understand that our thoughts, right, we can think and stop reacting like Boo Boo the monk, the bear, and we can start actually thinking like a human being and decide what vibration we're going to be in. And if you cannot do this, you will never have any success in life, period. You're going to be thrown all over the place like boo-boo and you will never get anywhere. But we can think and decide what our emotions or the vibration we're in. Even when you die, your body still lets off a heat signature, energy. When you stare at the back of somebody's head, what happens... You sometimes stare around in class or when you're in a class, somebody's staring at you. It's creepy. You stare, I practice it. Stare at somebody's rearview mirror, if only if you can multitask, if you're a good multitasker or you're thinking. Stare at the back of somebody's rearview mirror while you're driving, and they will always, 100% of the time, they always look back at me. I think of somebody before I go to sleep. The mind, right, is what directs all of the energy passing through us. I think of somebody before I go to sleep they always message me. Sometimes you're thinking of somebody and they call you, right? They phone you or they text you nowadays. And it's very important to understand this 
Because energy is all that there is, right? The physical world is an illusion. Energy is all that there is. That's why when I die, I can tell you where heaven is. Heaven's on earth. Because energy is all that there is. And when you understand and love yourself like I was talking about earlier without starting a whole other lesson, you embrace the soul that you are on the inside and you let go of the physical world. This is, why, this is, how you, this is very powerful. The most liberating freedom and power in life. You discover your life purpose. And then you combine the ability, what I'm teaching you, the subconscious mind and thinking, our spiritual mind, you can do anything. As long as obviously you're operating through the vibration of love that I talked about, 528 hertz, you operate on this high frequency, the vibration of love, you're able to manifest with the law of attraction like that. Now there's 11 other universal laws that you have to understand with the law of attraction, but that's a different video. <laughs> the subconscious mind, why did I bring this up? Our subconscious mind has 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts a day. This is where the energy is at. Our subconscious mind, your subconscious mind, is 20,000 times more powerful than your conscious mind. I just told you why. We got 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts directing all of our body, your body. Your body is a molecular structure that vibrates accordingly to the frequency that you are operating on. What the hell did he just say? Basically, basically, in summary, your, your subconscious mind, these 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts that are stimulating through your mind, and this is how we're all hard-coded, unless if, you know, like I said, you're from another planet, this is how we're all hard-coded, 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts going through your mind is deciding and directing the molecular, the vibration you're in, right? The physical body is an illusion, right? So if this is an illusion, all there is is a vibration and a frequency that is vibrating the cells and the atoms in your body. All of your skin cells, all of your physical cells are just vibrating on the frequency that you're on. Does that make more sense, maybe? So your subconscious mind is then deciding what vibration you're operating on it and you know your skin cells are going to start responding to the subliminal affirmations I am now allowing my skin cells to right this is how we've cured lipidema autoimmune disorders, thyroid issues people don't need surgeries anymore I can go down the long list because we implant and I don't like the word implant because people start freaking out we reprogram the mental algorithms through affirmations through listening <laughs> we'll use that word through listening we reprogram the subconscious these 50,000 to 100,000 deep thoughts our thoughts your thoughts create the neural pathways in your brain oh my god guys let me repeat that okay this is why i just this is why i say this like i do your thoughts create the physical brain. Wow. And there's one criminal family. Now we all understand this, right? Now it's safe to say, now that we all understand how this works, there is one criminal family that owns the dead news and the dying media. You bet you they've been implanting your subconscious mind with all kinds of disgusting ideas. And what do you hear on the nightly news over and over and over and over and over and over again? Health problems, health problems, health problems, health problems, health problems, health problems, health problems. Oh my God, it's been a lot longer than 21 days. And then what happens when someone turns 60? Well, now they need prescriptions that this one criminal family owns from the pharmaceutical companies. And when YouTube child content creators want to get paid, this, this one family passes a law from their bought off politicians that YouTube child content creators can no longer get paid because they don't want the children watching other content and programming the subconscious minds of their matrix or their rat race. But there are billions of people waking up and it's time for you to join us and stop being not just boo-boo but whipped around like a scapegoat. And I don't say that because I'm insulting you. I'm saying it because it's the truth. And you speak the truth, you are going to offend a lot of people. It's the cover picture on my Facebook page, my personal Facebook page. And somehow, like, 47 people found me somehow and are following me. It's kind of creepy. But anyways, your subconscious mind, guys, these mental algorithms, 
And we write all of our subliminal affirmations through the vibration of love. I use the vibration of 528 hertz that vibrates through all of Earth that scientists put down into an ocean and cured oil spilled water in one day. I use this vibration and I use the vibration of faith in our subliminal affirmations because our thoughts decide what vibration we're in. And it disgusts me how all of these spiritual awakening YouTube channels make these meditations, which are great. Don't get me wrong. It's still great how many lives they helped. I'm, I'm very grateful, but it's still very backwards and disgusting what they're doing because even though a billion people have listened to the love frequency collectively in just four years, which you, you will never hear on, on this criminal family's media or marketing, I call it the marketing they do, right? That's all it is. This fact, you will never hear that the health and wellness industry is a trillion dollar industry. And we use this vibration of love right through affirmations first because the thoughts are what create the vibration a frequency cannot change your life it starts up here uh, meditating to a frequency is no different than taking adderall or a prescription that's going to just numb out the problem the real problem is in your dna or your hard coding of the algorithms in your subconscious mind that we have discussed today and you now understand how subliminal affirmations work and this is how we're all all hard-coded all around the world hey did you fall asleep there snickers oh <laughs> anyways guys in summary in summary like i said the physical world is an illusion i already gave you examples for that in summary there is dna right the strings of coding in our genes and our dna that klutz shannon discovered and we are discovering, embracing this more and more and more to very complex levels. Did you know that a power meditators that have meditated for, for at least 20 or 30 years, their brain is operating on gamma. If you meditate for 20 or 30 years full time or consistently, you are using 100% of your brain. Your brain is 100% activated. We don't need chips in our brain. Besides maybe getting rid of physical activity where we don't have to walk to the air conditioning anymore. We can just turn it on with our minds maybe. But the natural powers of the mind, if you actually understand, is mind-boggling, guys. It's, I just told you all the diseases we've cured. But you have to understand it, right? And sad on 90% of people that write, make subliminal affirmations don't even know how to write a proper affirmation. Let alone everything else we've talked about in this... I, I, I don't have time to teach a 72 hour course on how, the how to write subliminals. This is how deep these operations and systems get of life and the universe and the subconscious mind. But I will tell you guys, this is how subliminal affirmations work on a very basic and understandable level that we can all understand. And like I said, the 50,000 to 100,000 thoughts that write the algorithms that are regenerating every day depending on what you are doing that then dictate the vibration that you're in Everything from your confidence, how you public speak, everything, everything in life. That your eye color, we are now understand why, everything starts with these algorithms. And to get even deeper real quick, I'm going to end this video on something a little bit deeper since I'm not at 25 minutes yet, which is my goal that I've been building towards or creating towards. I will tell you, I will tell you that energy flows, like I said, up. Energy flows through all of life. Even the rainbows in the galaxies vibrate on 528 hertz. The stars vibrate on 528 hertz. This is why we decide and we dis dictate where the tarot cards are going to go. We're not reading tarot cards based on this one criminal family's reality that they're creating. We have the ability to think and use our spiritual gifts and reprogram our subconscious mind through thinking when we discover our true self on the inside and decide how the planets are gonna gravitate and vibrate. Because energy, like I just told you, flows through all of life, even the stars and the galaxies, right? And it flows through us. It flows through us, but where does it flow through? Our sub, your subconscious mind. This is why your subconscious mind is 20,000. And we, I just, oh my God, we could do anything with this, guys. That, that's what my point was. And this is the, this is how subliminal affirmations work. And we have, I believe, five or six more videos that I've made for free 
because I'm sick and tired of all of these people just trying to get attention or talk about something they don't even understand out of selfishness, just where they can try to get subscribers for a couple of years and then they're just going to disappear. One hit wonder, this is no, this is not mommy and daddy's old wine. This is not getting a one hit wonder personal brand off of Google ads. And then and now I got to use a bunch of Lamborghinis and girls with their fake boobs because I have nothing else to offer you. No. No. I've already gave you my credibility. This is called hard fucking work. This is called 15 hours a day still, even while after cleaning shit off of toilets, like I said, and self-improving through 30 jobs and studying this my entire life and traveling the world to where I'm now working alongside international leaders with the nonprofit. This is completely different. And this is why I do what I do. Because like I said, if one of you guys can succeed, we all succeed. And this is why I do this, guys. I wish you the very best. Share this video with your friends or your family that don't quite understand what subliminal affirmations are or subliminal messages. And they want to understand more, right? They want to grow more. I wish you all the very best. And like I said, share this video, guys. Enjoy it. Enjoy your day. I love all of you guys and appreciate all of you guys.